One month ago, I uploaded a tutorial showing how to create rolling end credits using the CapCut app. Unfortunately, that tutorial works fine if you have a small list of end credits. But if you have long end credit list, then it will not work. This I came to know when one of the YouTube viewer posted a comment and asked me if I can make tutorial for long end credit. Thanks to that viewer. In today's tutorial, you will learn how to create rolling end credits for long list of end credits. Let's get started with today's tutorial. As you can see on the screen, I have already prepared the end credits with a long list in note taking app which is notes in my mobile. Obviously, you can create such a list in any text editor such as Word or your inbuilt default note taking app. First, select all the text and then tap on copy to copy it. Now, we will create the image of this text in another app which is pixel lab or text lab. I am going to use the text lab. The link is in the description if you want to install the same app. So let's go to that app. The text is already selected so tap on the delete button to delete it. Tap on ok to confirm it. Let's resize the canvas size. Tap on the three dots at the top. Tap on the image size. The width Let's change it to 1080 and the height to 1920. So the aspect ratio is nothing but 9 to 16 like a vertical video. This height is perfect for the list which I have for the end credits. In your case, if your list is longer than mine in this tutorial, then maybe you need to find the appropriate value for the height. The width maybe you can keep as it is 1080, but for height you have to find it by trial and error. So it can be 3000, 4000 or 5000. Click OK. Let's change the background color. Tap on the fourth icon which is nothing but the two squares overlapping on each other. Tap on the color and select the black color. Click OK. Now to add the text tap on the A icon. Tap on the plus button or the text. Then tap on the edit option. So delete the existing text then tap and hold on the blank screen it will pop up the paste option so tap on that what will happen we already copied some text in the note editor and or the text editor this will be copied here so click ok currently the formatting of the text is not good so scroll the options at the bottom go to the align tap on that and there are three different justifications we want it centric so tap on the second icon to make it centric click ok as you can see the text is not fitting into the height so we have to change the size of the text and for that there should be an option called size so tap on it reduce the size and using the one finger try to adjust it till you find the correct value of the size for the text so i think 23 is okay in my case click okay and now we have to make the text centric so tap on the relative position to make text centric horizontally tap on the second icon in the first row and to make it centric vertically tap on the second icon in the second row click OK to save the image tap on the save button and then tap on save as image save to gallery and the image will be saved now let's go to the CapCut app tap on new project to start the new project and go to the location where the image would have been saved by the text level select that image tap on the add it will be added to the project now currently the video format is vertical to change it to the horizontal video scroll the options at the bottom tap on the format button and then select 16 as to 9 so the video will be changed to the horizontal format but as you can see the text is not visible but that problem can be solved by using the two fingers and zooming into the image like this so as you can see now it is visible currently the duration of the image is only three seconds so select that image, drag the end of that image towards the right hand side 
and increase the duration in my case for this list 15 seconds is okay depending upon how fast or slow you want the end credits you have to find the appropriate timing in your case for your end credit list now go to the starting of the timeline let's use the keyframes keyframe is nothing but the diamond shape with plus icon so tap on that to insert the first keyframe at the start and then using one finger drag the image downwards till it is invisible so the list shouldn't be visible on the screen and make sure that the vertical blue line is also visible which means it is snapped to the center horizontally then go to the end of the timeline so around 15 seconds and then move this image upwards again till all the text is invisible and also make sure that the image is snapped into the center like this another keyframe will be added automatically at the end and now let's preview it by tapping on the play button and that's how you can create the rolling end credits even if you have a very long list of the end credits if you like this tutorial click on the like button subscribe to my channel in the description you can find the playlist for more capture related tutorials if you are interested into that if you like the light motion app then there are few tutorials i have made before the playlist can be found for that also in the description stay safe Stay healthy and please subscribe to my channel.